Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today is what I got for Christmas. Disclaimer, this is not a bragging video. This is not one to be boasting about. This is simply me showing what I got for Christmas. And if you like the stuff, you can get yourself it or your loved ones or whatever. Most of the stuff that I got is from Amazon. So you can have a little look on Amazon if you want. The first section of this video will be colouring related and the end of the video will be dye and paint related. The first item is not even colour related or dye and painting but it is to do with the background of the videos hopefully if this is big enough. This is a gaming mat and it's of the Mandalorian and Baby Yoda and hopefully this should be the background for you guys to go see. Little baby odor and all that. Hopefully. If it looks a bit weird, I won't do it, but that's my plan for that. The next one was the lossy accents I got. I um, have got the accent right here. But it is like quite full, but the nib's a little bit like messed up to be honest. So I want to add this one to have it as backup. I got loads of Halloween sticky notes. Sorry for the rattling, guys. But we are going to have a little look at these because I haven't even had a look at them myself. Do you know the actual sticky thing with feathers? You guys know I absolutely love sticky notes. I love like different shaped ones. So we got the Grim Reaper, got two little packs of them. We got a Dracula gravestone. You got two packs of each one, I think. Got like a little creepy hand. So cute down there. Oh, that one's really cute, isn't it? The bat. And the little ghost. A mummy. You got a cauldron. Black kitty. Spider. A little witch. These would be cute for when you're doing finished pages. Because as you guys know, I love spooky stuff. Pumpkins. Frankenstein, another pumpkin one, another little monster, and another cauldron one. So they're all my new post-it notes. I got some new markers. I'm not pronouncing it because I just can't pronounce it. But these are like... My elite ones where they got a fine nib and a chisel nib. I'll probably do a picture next colour and chat with these to see how they are. So we'll get AC in them. Now for the colouring books that I got. I got Monster Munchies colouring book. And this is by no idea no idea but it's just just trying to have a little look quickly nope no idea but these are just adorable little monster foods I 
like cute creepy they're so really really cute next one is alien animals this one is by again a bit awkward no idea but there's the ISBN numbers for you and it has little like dialogue for each one of them and it's really cute so this one's like planet or origin is bibble nine and it's five feet tall and it's a desert drooling rough so you can make that like a sandy color if you really wanted to you know really get your imagination going these can be any colors you want they're just really cute monsters and i really like it I love that one because that looks like my dog. That one looks like our Mitty. <laughs> the next book I got is Spooky Boy. I've been wanting this one for the longest time. And this is by this artist here. I love Spooky Girl, I love the art style of that, so I really wanted Spooky Boy. I think I just need Spooky Family now and I think I've got like the whole like collection line. And he's really cute and he's in the same style as Spooky Girl. The next couple of books are a little bit different. It's colour by maths. If you have little kids and you want them to get better in maths and all that, these books are really, really good. This one is for six to eight year olds and this one's for eight to 12 year olds. But it's also good for me as well because sometimes I want a little bit different colouring book. So what you do in this is you have your little maths equation, like, it's really simple because it is based for children. But you get your little maths equation and then you got your answers there. One of them's the answer. And then you just colour it in the colour that it is there. And I think it's a really unique way of like learning kids, making yourself like do a little bit of work while doing colouring in, you know what I mean? Like it's kind of like colour by number with a twist so i really like the idea of that and it seemed really fun to do so i got that for christmas and the other one is a multiplication and division one which i'm not that good at doing these ones the multiplications i am but the division ones i'm really 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 bad at so but these are for kids, so hopefully I should be okay with it. But who knows? And this is 8 to 12 year old, so should be okay. Bit of fun, isn't it, guys? This one I'm really excited for is Chris Ran Randiak, whatever his name is. Morning Scribbles current book, and it is the pastel one because I know he has quite a few of them and this is just the cutest book I have ever seen in my life like in my life I am doing a flip through of all the colouring books that I did receive for you guys so be on the lookout for them and if you have any of the colouring books I have and you want to do a buddy colour, let me know in my DMs on Instagram or even let me know in the comments down below and I'll definitely do that with you. Now, 
I have a crap ton of diamond paintings and I want to warn you guys it will be rattly from now so we are going to have a little look at this big packet of diamond paintings I'm not going to unravel them and all that I'm just going to show you the thumbnails This is a collection that I want. I've still got to get about eight of them left. But it's like the silhouette type of collection for Disney. And I've got pretty much all of them, but like I said, eight of them. This one is Pocahontas, I think. Can you see that, guys? I don't know if you can. I do apologise if you can't. This one is Pocahontas. And it's has 16 colours in it. And as you guys can see, it's really clear. And these are all by the same company, which is really, really good. Um, I'm trying to figure out where to put these. This is a lot. This one is... I think it's Arna. If I get any of them wrong, please let me know. And this one has 16 colours again. I'm going to use a lot of black. <laughs> so what my plan is with these is to like do them all and then frame every single one of them. And make like a massive like wall of them. This one's Alice in Wonderland. These are all 30 by 40 by the way guys and this is 16 colours. And these are all round drills as well. This one is Ariel and Flounder, 30 by 40 and this one has 20 colours, that one has a bit more colour in that one. This one is our favourite girl Rapunzel because she is like the artist of the princesses and this one has 20 colours as well. And 30 by 40. This one is Snow White. And this one's 30 by 40. And this one has 16 colours. If you would like me to show you all the diamonds for the diamond paintings, I can do a separate video for you guys. This one is, who are you? You are Belle. And it's 30 by 40 and it is 14 colours. That's probably one of my um, least colour palettes out of my whole collection. That's definitely the smallest amount of colours. This one is Elsa. She's a 8 by 40 and 14 again. I'm praying them full. <laughs> this one is Tinkerbell. 8 by 40 and 14 colours again. On to the next big bunch of them. This one, um, I think this is just miscellaneous ones. Again, I do apologise for the right one. This one is the Disney Castle. And it probably has a little bit more than... 23 colours. I don't want to open it. <laughs> yeah, it has 25 colours in this one. 
a 30 by 40 and there is the thumbnail if you didn't see it and the field looks really nice and clear I don't want to unwrap them all because you'll be here all day as you guys can see I've got a load of them this one is a Mario one which I've never had before so that's a nice addition 26 colours 30 by 40 and as you can see it's quite clear these are all round again guys round drill kits for me is like perfect this one is Elsa this one looks a bit more pixely to be honest 25 colours They're not fuzzy, they're quite like clear to be honest. But the face looks a bit weird, but forgot about these. This one is a stitch one. I've always wanted this one. I see so many people do this one. It's so stunning when it's done. 30 by 40 and 17 colours. This one is brilliant for if you're a beginner. Brilliant. I see so many beginners use this one as a beginner one. Nice clear field. Next one is a Rapunzel one. This one has 20 colours. 30 by 40. This one is, I think, Baby Yoda. Yeah, it's Baby Yoda. And this one is 20, 30 by 40. And as you can see, it's nice and clear. If I can see, because I'm showing nothing on camera. 30 by 40. This one is the Lion King one. Has Simba, Pua, and Timon on it. And this is 25 colours and nice field again. The next one is a Mickey and Minnie lovely one. That would be nice for Valentine's Day. I think this just has 24. But we can just go and check. Nope, 28 colours it has. 40 by 30. So it's more wider and a little bit shorter. And again, the field's nice. It looks really pinky. That would be perfect for Valentine's Day. So I'm going to try and finish the one I've done. Get that one up. For Valentine's Day, that'd be nice. Sorry guys. And this one is um the live action Little Mermaid one and this one has it looks like about 32 colours, maybe a bit more. It's got a lot of colours in this one. And the field's lovely. And again, 30 by 40. The next one is a bunch of the silhouette ones again. Again, I do apologise for the rattle one. I think it's really annoying. This one is Cinderella. No called the Snow White then. Cinderella. She has 15 colours and again, nice field I just can't wait to get these done 30 by 40 my multi places will love me with these this one is the beautiful Aurora or Sleeping Beauty and this is 17 colours 30 by 40 
again lovely i love the colors for this one i really do it's lovely like green and a little bit of yellow it looks stunning this one is jasmine I love that it's got Aladdin in the background here on the carpet but he looks a bit weird on the canvas but you know she looks stunning so it's fine 30 by 40 13 colours in this one the next one is I think it's Tiana yep Tiana and she has 16 colours, 30 by 40, and the field is nice. And I love the colour palette for hair as well. I love hair colours all the time. The next one is Moana, I think. No, yeah, Moana. It's Moana, 30 by 40, 14 colours. The field looks absolutely amazing. Again, I can't wait to start on any of these. And this one, I think, is Meg. Yeah, this one's Meg from Hercules. 13 colours. Love the purples and pinks in this. This one will be fun. You can even do a rainbow challenge if you wanted to with these. Let me pack them up in rainbow order. And the last little bunch that I've got is this one. And I've got an extra one I forgot about is this one. This looks like it glows in the dark, but it doesn't. It's a Jack and Sally, and I think it says their love never dies and this is 21 colors and this is 30 by 30 it's a nice small one and again it's um round drills and the field looks lovely and we got i think this is poison ivy this is 30 by 40 21 colours, again, gorgeous colours, love that orange with the green, absolutely love it, I love how they've done all these, they're absolutely stunning, this one is another aerial, but I think it's with Prince Eric, 30 by 40 and 19 colours, Again, the field is lovely. All of these are round, like I've kept saying, you guys. This one here is Bell with a book. And 30 by 40. And this one is 16 colours. Again, the field is beautiful. The colours are breathtaking. I can just imagine seeing them all done. I'm hoping they're looking better than what I'm thinking they are. This one, I'm not too sure who it is. So if you guys know, please let me know. It's this one here. It looks amazing. It's 20 colours. And it's got all blues and pinks and purples and blacks. It's really cute colours. Like really, really nice colours. And the last two are Mother Gothel, 30 by 40, and this one has 14 colours, lovely reds and pinks in this one. Completely stunning. And the last one is another aerial, but it's a different colour combination. 
30 by 40, 18 colours, pinks and blues and blacks and that one. The ones I am missing, if I remember off the top of my head, is Beast, Aladdin, um, Maleficent, um, there's a couple of other ones. I can't remember the other ones, but there's a few other ones. There's at least like eight of them that I am missing. So hopefully I get them for like my birthday or just throughout the year next year. So hopefully I get them and then I'll complete the whole set. So yeah, that's all what I got for Christmas this year, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, turn the notification bell on. Don't forget to follow my Instagram, follow my Facebook group page and also give my TikTok a little bit of love. I love you guys so, so much. Stay safe, respect one another and always spread some love. Love you. Bye.